Okay, so let's get into this tutorial. So I'm going to go ahead and start off with my Smashbox Photo Finish Primer. I'm also going to apply my NRC Mist. So next I'm going to go ahead and apply some tape to the outer portion of my from right underneath my lash line to the corner of my eyebrow. Now before I actually apply the tape, I normally stick it to the back of my hand just to get some of the adhesive off. Um, that way once I pull it off, it's not too harsh or not too hard to pull off and it doesn't tug too much. I'm just applying that to the other eye. Next, I'm going to go in with my Medusa's Makeup Stick It Primer and a flat shader brush. I'm just going to apply that all over my eye, from the base of my eye all the way to my brow bone, and also on my lower lash line. And applying my primer to the other eye. I know it looks like I'm not really putting anything on there, but <laughs> I'm definitely putting product on there. The product appears to be like a creamy color, but when you put it on, it actually comes off clear. So this is the first time I'm actually using this product. So let's see how it goes. Next I'm going to go in with the Medusa color Electro Black. I'm just going to take a um, pretty much like a pencil brush and start applying that in my crease. And it was really pigmented the first time I put it on considering that I only like dipped my brush into it. So that was pretty impressive. So now I'm just going ahead and applying that to the crease of my other eye just to make it even. I'm taking a clean fluffy brush um, and I'm just going ahead and buffing that into my crease. Next I'm going to go in with that flat eyeshadow brush and I'm packing on Electro Orange. I'm just packing on the color onto my eyelid. I'm avoiding the inner corner of my eye just so I can put in another color there. All of the Medusa shades that I have do have shimmer in them, so this look is pretty shimmery. So I'm just continuing to pack on that color to the intensity that I'd like. Considering I didn't put on a white Primer, color primer on my eyelid. The colors did come out very intense. Once. 
Now I'm going to go in with my NYX color in black and with a fluffy brush I'm just going to blend that into my crease on top of the electro black. So I'm just blending out the crease color just to ensure that there aren't any harsh lines. Next I'm going to take that fluffy pencil brush, go back into the NYX black eyeshadow and I'm just going to intensify the outer corners and I'm just blending that deeper into the crease. Next I'm taking the NYX color in Nude and an Angle Fluffy Brush by e.l.f. and I'm just going to go ahead and apply that to the brow bone, blending the color Nude into the color Black. I'm going to go ahead and remove the tape and I'm going to take Electro White and a fluffy angle brush and I'm just going to go ahead and place it on the inner corners of my eye. Now this white definitely did have a lot of fallout, so I was trying to avoid it from falling into my eye. Next I'm going to take a just a fluffy little brush by e.l.f. and I'm just going to go ahead and blend that white color into the orange. Next, I'm just going to pack on more of that orange to intensify that look. Next I'm going to take this fluffy crease brush, just a small crease brush, and I'm just going to blend out any harsh lines that I see. I'm going to go ahead and line my eyes with the Essence Eyeliner. Next I'm going to go ahead and apply Electro Orange to my lower lash line right in the middle of my eye. I'm going back in with that Electro Black and taking a smudger brush and applying that to the outer corners of my lower lash line. Dragging that into the orange just to blend everything all together.
Next, I'm going to go ahead and apply my lashes. Those are the Kara lashes, number 43. And I'm applying my foundation now. I'm using the NC44 Studio Sculpt by MAC with a e.l.f. small stippling brush. just buffing everything in. So now I'm just cleaning up my brows. I've already gone ahead and done my brows off camera. I'm actually taking the same uh, foundation, the NC44 Studio Sculpt, and I'm basically just cleaning up the top of my eyebrows. And I'm using a MAC 195 brush. Next I'm going to use my LA, or LA Girl HD Concealer and this is in the color Warm Honey. I'm just applying that um, anywhere that I'm looking to highlight my face. Under my eyes, uh, my nose, my forehead, my cupid's bow, and my chin. Concealer in the color yellow, right on top of that. And I'm going to go ahead and blend that all together with this beauty blender dupe sponge thing. <laughs> Next I'm going to go into my Anastasia contour kit and use the color banana to highlight under my eyes, down my nose, my forehead, my cupid's bow, anywhere that I place concealer.
Next, I'm gonna go in with the contour lava, and I'm just gonna go ahead and contour my face. Next I'm taking a fluffy brush by e.l.f. This is a powder brush and I'm actually going to take this bronzer by Arbonne and I'm just going to buff that into my cheeks anywhere that I've, I contoured. Next, I'm going to go into my MAC Mineralize Skin Finish in the color Medium Deep. And with a fluffy powder brush, I'm just going to go ahead and apply that to my face. Just blending everything in, avoiding my under eye area where I place the banana powder. Next, I'm going to go in with my Hard Candy 3 set, and I'm going to take that pink color, and I'm going to use it as my blush. I'm going to take a clean Quo brush, and I'm just going to go ahead and buff that out. Next, I'm going to apply my Tarte Amazonian Clay Mascara. And my lower lashes. And I'm just going to go ahead and curl or press my natural lashes into the falsies. Next, I'm going to take the MAC Lip Prep and Prime to prime my lips. And I'm going to apply this Revlon lipstick in the color pink in the afternoon. And that is the final look. Thank you very much guys for watching my video. I greatly appreciate it and I had a lot of fun making it for you guys. If you guys enjoyed this tutorial, please leave a comment, rate, or subscribe.